Welcome to Mosquito Render's Daylight Simulation System video. In this video, we will discuss how Mosquito Render supports the Daylight System in 3D Studio Max. However, before we do this, it is important to understand that Mosquito Render uses a very unique way to handle colors. Mosquito Render is a true spectral-based rendering system, so colors are created based on electromagnetic wavelengths. In this scene, we have a standard 3D Studio Max daylight system, and this daylight system uh, right now has Mosquito Sun as the only active component. Mosquito Sun is a combined uh, daylight simulation system that includes all aspects of a daylight system. It includes the sun, the skylight and the environment as well. So all aspects, all parameters are handled by one single uh, setting. Let's call Active Shade now and see how we can adjust our daylight system and how it looks like. So you can adjust the daylight system like any other system uh, based on the time of day. And as you adjust the parameters, you will see instant, immediate uh, feedback, including shadows, colors, global illumination, ray reflections, refractions. You can fine-tune when you go to the minutes, so you can really pinpoint and adjust your sunset as you wish. And again, it is important to understand that the background you see here, the environment, the sky, the actual sky component, is handled all in one system. So in contrast to the other uh, renderers that separate the sun and sky, Mosquito Render is able to render everything in one go and this is why the simulation is much more accurate and much more natural and realistic than any other skylight system you might have seen on 3D Studio Max. You can adjust things like the sun disk size for example and again you will get real-time feedback can adjust all the individual components like the sun's intensity, the direct light component, and you can also adjust the uh, sky itself, which is more of an ambient uh, illumination effect. So all these parameters and components can be adjusted in real time. Let's assume you have assets already created and they use the uh, mental ray sun and the mental ray sky. You can just activate those components and Mosquito Render will exactly behave like a 3D Studio Max renderer should behave. So Mosquito Render supports the MR sky as well, including the MR physical sky environment map. So all these aspects are now also available to Mosquito Render and it uh, supports it. If you are now going to adjust anything in the map, you will see that in real time as well. And you can dial in the numbers, you can play around with the settings. All this is working in real time as well. And that's the great flexibility Mosquito Render has. It offers you all the power, all the available features and functions of 3D Studio Max are working. You can adjust the sun intensity, you can adjust the sky intensity, all these parameters work as you would expect it.